What's up guys, Matco Michaels here, and you know he's always got that truck loaded down, so let's take a look and see what he's got. You guys, come on. It's cool, ain't it? It is, it is. It's days like today that make you appreciate the uh, that good Matco jacket. <laughs> I have definitely enjoyed it this week. A lot. Yeah, it's been cold this week. I've sold a bunch of jackets this week. <laughs> we knew it was coming. Of course, we sold out of the most popular sizes, so I had to start getting them from other distributors. Well, I mean, guess extra large and 2X. 2X and 3X. Really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I didn't order enough of them and they were limited quantity you know special order kind of deal uh I, I guess you wouldn't say limited quantity it's just you ordered as many as you wanted and that's all you got basically yeah so now it's kind of picking from other distributors you know did you order too much so i had a distributor that's helped me out twice now so uh they're gonna be christmas presents to the employees so yeah they're nice they warm right i've worn mine for the last pretty much two weeks so yeah well, so you got the Christmas deal. Christmas on deal there. going on. I just knew one of these boxes would be gone. Well, you know, it's Christmas time. It's, it's hard to sell boxes during Christmas. It ain't because there ain't good boxes here to sell. So, What know. better Christmas present than can you really pick out, you know? Well, everybody's trying to, to pinch up every little cent to, <laughs> to give gifts and stuff like that. So uh, income tax season is right around the corner. So, mm -hmm. boxes will start selling. Yeah. But that's okay. They look good on the truck. Uh, if that one back there stays much longer, it might roll off the back. Uh, <laughs> he says that every time. Yeah. Well, like, I, yeah. the day comes when he finally says, I'm going to keep a box, call me, and I'm going to come over and video the whole thing because <laughs> nobody will ever believe nobody that. Nobody will believe it. Nobody will believe that. Well, and it'll probably honestly unroll, roll back on a couple times, and, <laughs> you know. Oh, I don't well. think I've ever bought any big purchase without thinking, uh, you know what, maybe should I? I can't say nothing. How long did I debate on my box before I pulled the trigger on it? That's right. Well, and if I if I worked on cars every day, I'd, I'd have it. Mm -hmm. My tools sit a lot now. I mean, I still work on cars every once in a while for family, but you know, I don't, I don't do it every day anymore. So well, I get to play with tools all day, but right. You know. I don't blame you though. What uh, <clears throat> I know you've seen the video we did last weekend when I was over at my brother's getting some presents wrapped. Oh, I loved it. So, for you guys that haven't seen that little short video, I did it just for fun, just playing, and uh, I'll put it in here and that way you can take a look at it. I think you're gonna really love what I got you for Christmas this year. Oh, baby, you went to Matco. It, yeah, it, it was perfect. We had actually had a couple of distributors shared it. Yeah. Uh, so, which uh, we had two or three wives buy stuff for their husbands this year mm -hmm. off the, the truck what better way to do it than that right yeah we always well, have shop owners that do it but you know every year there's always that he went to jared commercial i was yeah. like you know what the guys need one so, you know yeah just something funny like that so well that's like she was talking yesterday she was watching something on tiktok about uh, how many men buy stuff for their women on mm -hmm. the tool trucks i mean that happens every year yeah uh whether it be sunglasses or uh, hoodies, jackets, you know, just random stuff here or there. I think I bought her some speakers and stuff one time off the tool truck. It was just there. That wasn't her only gift, but what better way to go out there and spend money on a tool truck? That's true. Well, my wife's birthday present came off of the tool truck this year at the meetup. There you I go. got her those sunglasses, yep. remember? She liked it. She was like, I really like those sunglasses. So I come back in here, I'm like, you remember which one it was? You're like, yeah, it was these. I'm like, all right, cool. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, picked them out. So. I mean, she, that, that's part of it. I think I actually won some Oakleys and gave them to her one time. Um, 
that that was actually when I was a distributor. I don't get that luxury anymore. I can't get off the tool truck because if she wants it, it's ordered, and the next thing I know, it's at the house. <laughs> it's like, well, who ordered this? I did. I said, oh, okay. Yeah. So that is what it is, though. I mean. Well, I got y'all a little present up there, but you can't open it until after I turn the video off because <laughs> I don't want everybody. Well, we're going to talk about the new tool. Uh, or I guess you can call it a tool. We ordered that back at Expo, um, and they had just come out. I just got my first one. It's been back ordered since Expo. Um, it's a measuring funnel. I know it's not the greatest tool ever, but if you're putting oil in something yep. or something else, funnels come in handy. Especially with a dust cap on it, because everybody knows you're always going to have a coated that's look it. like a powdered donut inside from sweeping or blowing That's stuff it. off well, or whatever. And the dealership that I worked at, the quick loop had hoses mm -hmm. that they could just run over to the vehicle and fill it up. We did not. So if we did any engine work or anything like that, we had to go out to the quick loop, fill up a jug. Yeah. Because bulk oil is cheaper than the bottle oil. Way cheaper. Yeah. So um, whereas warranty may pay for the bottle oil customer don't want to pay that extra for a bottle of oil so we'd have to go out there fill a jug up come back and some of those tundras held you know seven eight gallons uh, gallons i'm quartz. sorry quartz Woo. no not gallons anyways <laughs> they'd hold a lot and uh we'd have to walk back we'd, it was so full with the one that we had you couldn't pour it right so you'd have to do two trips to make it you know right. half and half this right here will hold it all and the way that it pours out you can see here you just walk over and pull that little button and it starts to drain in there. So mm -hmm. that would have been perfect. There's no, this one you had a, a hose and you'd have to kind of lift. Well, by the time you had enough in there, you were just one, you know, hair away from pouring it out the top and going everywhere. Right. So I like this funnel. Uh, we've showed a different type, you know, different types of funnels. This is one of my favorite. We ordered the Expo. I, if nobody else is gonna buy it, I was gonna use it on my truck, but we'll open it up and look at it. So, yeah, you just pull the lever up. When you pull the lever up, it actually opens the valve in the bottom and that allows you to fill it up. That's cool right there. It's got a screen down there too, so your big trash and stuff like that mm -hmm. is gonna catch. Uh, I like the dust cover and then it's got this little stand so you fill it up you sit it there you do what you got to do and then you put the oil in there yeah so I like that um, if you've ever did a whole lot of oil changes I think it would come in handy it says recommended use diesel kerosene uh, diesel gasoline kerosene oils and etc do not use with water base so probably too thin for it yeah I think the only thing that I see that may be an issue is it only holds two quarts. So, yeah. I mean, it's probably gonna be a slow go type of deal, but um, I like it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Now, now I'm, I must have been out of the world too long because I can't even remember what the exact number that the Tundra's held. I know it wasn't gallons for sure, mm -hmm. but I can't remember if it was seven quarts or seven and a half. I can't remember. I think it was seven, seven and a half, but either way, I like the funnel. Well, y'all ready for a big Christmas, I guess? Yeah, we everything are. Everything bought? And we, we, yeah, everything's bought. I actually picked hers up last night. This is the first year that I just couldn't think of anything. I mean, I had her one gift already that she knew about, but she kind of cheated she asked me if i wanted this for christmas and i said yeah and then hers was done and she wouldn't give me any type of you know. <laughs> now after i ordered after she saw me order something she gave me a whole bunch of stuff was it this is it that and i was like eh, probably should have said i ordered something already <laughs> got it out of you that's all right i think she'll be happy with it i've heard her ask for it before well, i've so. got all of mine done and i reckon we're finished with everybody so finished with everybody yeah yeah um christmas is going to be different this year for for a lot of people so mm -hmm. you know i've heard some people say christmas ain't gonna be christmas this year but i think that's only if we let it be that way you yeah know. well we're gonna have a good time and that's right caroline's gonna have some cool stuff so that's all that really matters anyways i've got three kids so they're gonna tear into theirs 
yep. regardless. And one's going to take everybody's toys away from each other, so it'll be fun. <laughs> we'll, we'll have fun. So. <laughs> you know, but well, it's one of those good. things. Did you get any more of those beanies back in? I have not got any of the black in yet. Um, I, the last I checked, it was showing that they were ordered. Uh, I'm still giving hope. I'm still running next week. So I'm still got hope that they'll be here by the time. If not, I know they ran them in a flyer too, so I would think that they had plenty yeah. of them. So I think now, as far as my cups go, the tumblers I sold every every one of them, and the little Lego block trucks I sold every one of them. So that's good. My beanies are the, my only hope of getting anything else in <laughs> for for kind of like novelty stuff to sell. So. Those beanies did really good, didn't they? They did good both years in a row. Um, I I thought the only downfall on them was the light being on them as well, because mm -hmm. some people liked the light last year, some people didn't. This year, it seemed to be a plus that it was on there. They had no decision to make. Okay, it's got yep. the light, it's got the Bluetooth. What more could I ask for? Yeah, uh, that's why I like it, because it's got the best of both worlds. Well, see, yeah. and if I'm not mistaken, the price was the same this year that they was last year. Mm -hmm. Last year, they just had Bluetooth or just the light. Right. So this year, it was like, oh, well, now I get... A Both light and yeah. that for it. So I sold. Well, you know, the guys that bought the light last year was yeah. wishing they'd have bought the Bluetooth. And then yeah. the guys like me that bought the Bluetooth one wished they'd have bought the light one. So. Yeah, so this year it had a little bit of both. I sold some to people that bought the ones last year, so I don't know. Yeah. I don't know what they're going to do. There was only really one person that bought last year. It was like, well, I've already got one. Everybody else just jumped on board, bought another one, and, mm -hmm. you know, the the same old story same old song that i'm always singing i didn't order enough the one time i ordered I, it's gonna happen i'm gonna order like a, a crap whole bunch of them won't be able to sell it that'd, sell it. that'd so, be my luck i guess the only problem that i can have in this business is not able to sell so i guess as long as it's selling be happy right that's it but. can't can't fuss about that all right, guys, well, we're going to turn this thing off like always. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, hit that thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise, cool tools, and discount codes over here. And for you guys that have waited for a long time, if your wife needs any gift ideas, you better get them to click that button up there because it's almost done. If y'all not subscribed, click that subscribe button. It's free. Never cost you a dime. You guys have a great week, and we will catch y'all next time. See ya.